Okie dokie. Hey there y'all, it's Renee. I just wanted to do a, a vlog, I guess, and talk about all kinds of exciting things. Um, first of all, most of all, is um, the photography. Wow. <laughs> I did, uh, this past week, I did a photo session um, with my with my granddaughters and it was awesome i mean it was i had a lot of fun with it the girls did so good um you can see where my photography is developing there are some things that um what are use the words huh um it, you know I, I i even looked back on them and thought some of those are a little um washed out it was the lighting and it's so hard to get it in our little tiny trailer we actually did it here in the living room to my right um with the girls and you know space is limited because we have the couch behind us and the entertainment center is kind of catty corner here and then this desk here so it was really cramped and tight so it was a good thing it was only two little girls that i was um shooting but um then I decided the other day when my brother came to do, um, I, so I could do his son's photos, my cute little nephew, Daniel, he's six months old. Um, we actually cleared our table out of our kitchen. We just have like a card table, fold up table and fold up chairs. So we took that out and there's a little more space in there. There's still, I'm still limited because, um, my backdrop is only five feet, five feet wide. So even though I have the extension to make the backdrop um, hanger or whatever you call it wider, I didn't have enough um, backdrop, <laughs> a wide enough backdrop. So I'm going to work on that, um, try to get some fabric and make a bigger backdrop or do something. It's just the, the seam in it is the thing that's the big deal. Every picture I take, I'm going to have to go in and erase that seam. Or blend it in or whatever you know um so anyway today i i tried to do a session um with my daughter my oldest daughter jana and her husband clinton and and my two little granddaughters lily and lexi it was really cramped and crowded and i think that that contributed to the girls getting grouchy and you know they it just didn't we did like 20 minutes and we were done because there was no getting them settled and I didn't really get a lot of good photographs out of it but I think my point started out as <laughs> that first session with my granddaughters just kind of lit it up on Facebook and I actually ended up getting like four emails which is doesn't seem like a lot to you guys but it's tremendous to me because people were asking me to take their photographs they're like, will you do mine? Will you do mine? Those are great. I love the pictures of your granddaughters. And then I posted the ones which I did yesterday of Daniel and got even more response. My sister-in-law's sister, -in -law's sister um, messaged me and said, I really want you to do my girl's photo portraits. And she has the cutest little girl, so I can't wait to do that. But it's like, you just, uh, I think for me, is finally deciding, look, I got to do this one way or the other. I'm going to show people who I am, what I can do, and let's just see how they react. And that was really, honestly, 95% of the reason I took my granddaughter's photographs because they're very photogenic. They're very cute little girls, and I knew it would be awesome. Um, and actually, uh, Lexi, my, um, my daughter Jana's youngest daughter, my middle granddaughter of the three she is she is less happy to have her photograph taken she just wants you to hold her she's a sweet little girl she loves to be held and she doesn't like to be told what to do though but she happens to be very photogenic her photos always come out adorable lily is absolutely adorable and loves the camera but <laughs> she tries too hard to pose and she'll you know, squeeze her little eyes shut, and it's, she has an awkward grin sometimes. It looks like she's forcing a smile on her face. Looks so, but when you get her relaxed, and you, it's more like with Lily working with the two little girls, I have to work differently, but at the same, working at the same time in different methods to get them to 
take a good photograph, you know, I have to kind of wait until Lily's kind of a little off guard so that she's not forcing a pose. And with Lexi, um, you just have to get keep snapping till you get a good picture with the two of them together. But it was a lot of fun, and I think I have begun to show people what I can do with photography. And I, I absolutely know that my field of um, specialty, I guess, in portrait photography is going to be children. Because I have tremendous patience with them, and I think they're beautiful. And I wouldn't care if a baby was squalling all day long. I, I could have... I could take breaks, let the baby get a little break, and I could take pictures of the same baby all day because I think they're beautiful. Love little children. I, I really especially love to photograph them in their element, you know, out playing and um, just kind of photos that look like, kind of like you caught them off guard, like they were out for a photography shoot, but they um, were caught off guard and just, excuse me, playing, you know, so... Anyway, um, I'm just, I'm so excited. I just feel something really um, tremendous with this, and I am enjoying it, and I cannot wait. My uh, niece's mother, is, uh, one of my brother's uh, oldest daughter, um, just had um, a ba her second child, and uh, her mother contacted me after seeing my granddaughter's photographs and asked me to do hers. And she actually had had another young lady to do photographs, and they did not turn out very well at all. I went back and looked at them, and it kind of hurt my feelings. You know, I got a little streak of, not jealousy, because she, um, it was more of, I'm her aunt. Why didn't she ask me to do those pictures? That kind of hurt my feelings. And I guess maybe it was um, her expecting me to ask. <laughs> but I said, I'm not going to. I, I told my daughter, I said, I'm. I'm not an experienced photographer, but I'm 41 years old. This other young lady is maybe 19, 20, and hasn't quite learned what she... You know, anyway, I'm not going to talk down about her because she tries really hard. But I do take better photographs than her. But I've, it's always been something I've enjoyed doing. My um, Actually, when I was younger, it was more landscape photography because I, I just enjoyed being out by myself when I got my first little... Kodak disc camera. I don't know if anybody remembers those, but I thought they were the coolest thing, and that's what I asked for for Christmas when I was, I guess I was 11, and Mama got it for me, and I would just spend hours by myself taking uh, photographs. I'd walk down to the pond or go over to my grandpa's farm, or, or I would go to my other grandpa's. To He had a really beautiful lake out in front of his, uh, he had an underground house, and he had built, made a lake out there, and I still have those photographs. I need to look them up, and if I can get my scanner working, scan them and show them someday on Facebook, because my mother really thought that would, it would be my niche if I ever got into photography, would be landscape, but it's not, I guess things changed when I had children, and I just think children are the most beautiful subject to photograph, so I'm definitely, um, I would aspire to be like Ann Gettys. I, I absolutely love children. I could put them in all kinds of different situations to photograph them. They look so cute when they're nestled and on a blanket sleeping or, or just playing, you know, so it's going to be fun for me. I'm excited. I'm really excited. And I have, um, that will be all total, I think about six family members or friends of family members who have asked me to do their portraits so yay <laughs> exciting and I just rattle on about that forever but that's a positive thing I'm not going to say anything negative in this you guys know what's going on with us around this time but I'm trying to keep my spirits up because I know that's the way the boss man would want it and definitely um, God has blessed me with plenty to do so it's it's easier because of that and I've got my focus on these adorable little babies adorable little children so thank you Lord for the blessings peace guys bye bye